As always, if you appreciate the content, if you like the fat red hamster or the awesome Rin wallpapers, please give a like and a sub because it'd be extremely appreciated. So I just thought I'd share a very simple configuration that will be useful to you and might not be um, so clear as to how to enable it. Uh, and that is FreeSync. So what is FreeSync? FreeSync allows your uh, monitor and your graphics card or the game itself, right, to adapt to each other. So uh, as the frame rate changes, right, the monitor's refresh rate will adapt to that to reduce tearing and latency. And it's just a better version of vSync. And vSync is, I guess, the more traditional way of doing things. But anyway, this will work on an AMD GPU. It's not for an NVIDIA GPU. And in fact, if you're on an NVIDIA GPU, which on Linux you probably shouldn't be, but NVIDIA has, I'm, ass I'm assuming, their own uh, method of doing this, which from what I've read is through the actual driver package. And there's an interface for it, like a graphical one, and it should work, or I'm assuming it'll work. I'm not really too sure because I've never used an NVIDIA GPU, but this method right here will work for an AMD GPU. And yeah, so the first step is to just install this uh, driver package for Xorg. And I think on Wayland, I forgot to mention that, uh, FreeSync might be enabled by default. I'm not too sure. I've never really used Wayland that much, so I don't know about configuring it. But on Xorg, this is how it's done, and Xorg works for me. I don't feel like there's a need to change, so I'm just going to stay here. And anyway, so yeah, once you install the driver package, then you create uh, the driver configuration. And since you know you're on a proper graphics card, right? I'm assuming. You really don't need to do many configurations here. For me, everything works out of the box. I don't really even need to create this file. Just for FreeSync, I made this file here. So anyway, within this file, we just have a few lines. And the most important one here that we need to focus on is this option here. So this is what actually enables uh, FreeSync. Now, one important thing to mention is you can also enable vsync in here with a tear free option and this can work together but variable refresh rate replaces vsync right so there's no need to really have uh, the two of them active together and they can be active at the same time and that will enable like some other sort of buffering um, to I guess further try to reduce tearing but for me personally want to have uh, this flag here, I don't really need to enable, you know, vSync. This does the job and it works well. Haven't noticed any problems in any games at all. So yeah. Anyway, once you've created that, close and save, then you have to either restart your PC or restart um, your session, right? So you have to kill Xorg and you could just do system CTL uh, restart and then here you put your display manager and I have uh, light DM so I do light DM but you can replace that with whatever you have and then to ensure that it's actually active we can just uh, search the Xorg log file here and we can see here that we do have variable refresh enabled and yeah, it's pretty straightforward, right? So I think that'll be it for this video. And again, if you appreciate the content, uh, you like the Rin wallpapers, the fat red hamster, please, of course, give a like and a sub. And I hope that you really find this useful in your Linux gaming endeavors.